Laura Vitale. On this episode of Laura in the Kitchen, I'm going to show you how to make spicy black beans. Now here's what you need. You need black beans. These are just canned, rinsed and washed. You need some onions, chopped onions, chopped jalapeno, chopped garlic, salt, pepper, dry bay leaves, a little cilantro, and some extra virgin olive oil. Now first thing you want to do is preheat your pan with about three tablespoons of extra, olive, of extra, of extra virgin olive oil that it's ready for you when you're ready to saute your veggies. Okay, my olive oil is nice and hot. I'm just going to add in my onions, my jalapenos, and my garlic. You want to just saute these until they get tender and translucent. Okay, it's been a couple minutes now. These are perfect. I'm going to add in my black beans. Now, these are just regular canned black beans, but you want to make sure to rinse them. Okay. Them all together. Now my version of these um, spicy black beans, they're really simple. I don't I don't go crazy with any kind of spices or anything like that because I really like the flavor of just the simplicity of the black beans with the jalapenos and the garlic and just a tiny bit of spice. I'm gonna just season it with salt and pepper to taste. Okay. A little bit of pepper. Now remember, black pepper hits you in a different note than a jalapeno would. Okay. I want to put in about two cups of water. Okay. And then I'm going to put in some bay leaves. And I just have regular dry bay leaves, so I'm just going to use a couple little pieces because they come all broken up. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna use two just a few little pieces. Okay. Medium high heat. You wanna put the lid on and you wanna let this cook for about twenty to twenty five minutes. Oh my goodness. Black beans are done. Look at that. They're nice and thick all the water has evaporated. Now before you serve this, make sure you take out your bay leaves because they never get soft no matter how long you cook them for. Here we go. Now these go perfect with um, with any traditional like Spanish meal, Mexican. I just, um, I will serve it with a little cilantro on top and a little dollop of sour cream. I hope you've enjoyed spending time with me. If you'd like to get this recipe and other recipes, visit my website at www.learnthekitchen.com. See you next time. Bye-bye.